Before modern telescopes, humans could only imagine what the surface of the Sun and the planets looked like. Now, advanced technology has made it possible to get in close and take images of the Sun and the planets deep in our solar system. Now, get ready to see the solar system as you've never seen it before and see images that were so good, they shocked astronomers. Mars has always been of great interest to humans. The fourth planet from the Sun, the Red Martian planet, has been studied heavily. The Viking Orbiter 1 took stunning snapshots of Mars in 1979, like this photo of the Valles Marineris. And the Viking 2 Orbiter snapped an image showing the southern polar plains and polar ice cap. In 2013, the Mars European Space Agency's Mars Express took highly detailed images of Hebes Chasma, the northernmost part of Valles Marineris, as seen in this movie created from the images. But since then, four rovers have already been on the planet's surface, studying and snapping photos. The images from the Mars Curiosity rover, including a selfie, were the most incredible images from the surface of an alien world. This is a 1.8 billion panoramic view, made up of over 1,200 images of Mars, as seen by Curiosity, which is still operational. The largest planet in our solar system, the gas giant Jupiter, has the most unique look of all the planets, with its giant great red spot, a storm on the planet that's been raging for 350 years, and is so large it could swallow the Earth whole. On July 10th, 2017, the Juno spacecraft flew just 5,600 miles above the Great Red Spot and nabbed the closest image of the massive storm ever taken. This image, a bit farther away, is a little bit truer in colour to what we would see if we were orbiting Jupiter. But Juno also captured unbelievable images of polar regions, which cannot be seen from Earth. And what surprised astronomers was that Jupiter's North Pole has eight storms swirling at its centre, and they're laid out in a precise geometric pattern, the storms appearing as stable fixtures in Jupiter's atmosphere, and not normal weather. But more incredible photos would come, and on November the 13th, 2018, a new image from Juno was created using data from the JunoCam imager that's nothing short of breathtaking. And on June 27th, 2019, the Hubble telescope captured the planet's trademark Great Red Spot, which researchers say is shrinking. We got an awesome video coming up on Jupiter, so make sure not to miss it.